Yeah, it's good. Just uh, all the skylights are nearly blacked out. Ah, oh, awesome. Ideal. Yeah, so I'm just driving up from Wales to get to the warehouse and um, see the set for the music video for the first time. It's been a long drive and I'm pretty excited to see how it's going to look. Two days and we'll be in our glad rags, hopefully filming. It's looking good though, eh? I reckon this old camera's older than me. Oh, this is amazing. No point in 4K. Oh, yeah, that's a Just trying to set all of the lights so we can fill the stage. There's a lot of lights. So, where are we going with that, we? Yeah, that's a bit more. Yeah, that's perfect. Look at that. <laughs> It looks like you're gonna you're about to do a period drama or something. <laughs> yeah, it's awesome. How excited are you? How are you starting to look? On a scale of one to ten, I am on eleven. Just like Spinal Tap. It's uh, we've actually got ourselves a real set, like a rock concert kind of thing. So it's, it's awesome. We've got the wigs, we've got the set, we've got the lights. Just need to start doing the writing. <laughs> She's probably evil. She's probably evil. <laughs> Back on the trailer here. Got the full rock effect. Getting your hair and makeup done. Just about. Just getting the fluff in. Look at these bad boys. Do they fit now? Or should I go for the black one? Look at the stage. <laughs> how, how, have you, how have you got to this stage? Like, where's this idea come from? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> kind of just made sense, I suppose. Drop and roll. Rock and roll. <laughs> and that is how it's done. There's some talk in it. Eh? Yes! Do you want to run over to the van? Just run. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Bro! That guy's Go on down. Go throw. Okay, now you both go. Catch, catch it out. Right, just, uh, look, look. <laughs> yes! 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 Oh, Danger on the set. Those helicopters. Oh, I'll just do it again. Let's go. 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 Yeah. Yeah. And the way I really like to work is with a really small, tight knit team, uh, and this one's no exception. I've worked with Robbie Mead uh, on a few films over the last few years, and often, you know, he's the, the guy that's manning out the steady cam or the Movi. It's been amazing working with Robbie on this film. You know, it's the first time that he's been the director. He's absolutely smashed it. What are you up to today? Just shooting some some profile shots. Fab was pretending to play guitar. Fab was giving it some good old Euro 
Euro cheese that only the, the Austrians can do. Yeah, it's going to be awesome to have Rutger here for the whole shoot to basically be capturing amazing photos along with the filming side. He's really good at sort of blurring the lines between sort of fantasy and reality, where you know that, you know, the writing or whatever's happening for real, you know, it's all for real, but you can't quite believe it looks like that, you know, so. Hmm. First day of filming, getting the clips. We got Ali, aka Mad Dog, in the house. Pretty awesome actually to be finally getting the clips. Got another six days left before I go away, so good start. I've not done anything, I've just been sat around all day, the usual. But um, hopefully I'll get some stuff built and I can do some clips tomorrow. Hurry up, Dali. Come out with a couple of ideas. Whether or not I can do them, I don't know, but we'll see. Yeah, I'm just trying to come up with crazy ideas, try and compete with these other guys. My riding, I don't tend to go for the, the big fancy stuff. I quite like the, the smooth technical stuff, and I think as far as lines go, that one, it, you know, I'm, I'm pretty happy with it. It shows off my style of riding quite well, I think. I think it should be holding the guitar. Alright, what do you think? <laughs> Perfect. Look at the fingers! Oh, need to do his feet as well. <laughs> <laughs> Give us a thing. Just kind of thing. Put in the course. I'm Danny, freaking maggot field. I do what I want. This is why I want to do it with Danny. <laughs> <laughs> oh wait, new type. <laughs> this is like one of those wacky babies. Yeah. <laughs> hey guys! <laughs> That's actually good. Luffy! <laughs> <laughs> I like this. Stop hitting you, sir. I can't believe this video is actually um, just, um, getting me. Like all that chat. All, that, all these stupid ideas, and here we are. <laughs> right, get that big head of yours in there. Then come to this side a little. <laughs> Hello. Ah. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> Do it again. shaping up well. I think, I mean, Fabio's absolutely killed it the last few days. I think he's done three times as much riding as the rest of us.
smashed out the uh, the backflip. How are you feeling? Yeah, so stoked. <laughs> like uh, it's been a bit of a roller coaster of a day. Fabio sent a pretty sweet trick earlier. Did like a tire tap, uh, tail whip, drop thing, which is definitely sort of like one of the banger tricks of the video. And then like once he did that, I was like trying to do a. Came up with a stupid idea of trying this like half cab over the spiky rail to land back on the rail and then ride along it. It took me like six hours of attempts or something. It just didn't work. I've been wanting to sort of go upside down in the video. I've never really done like flips before, like onto wood. So I was like, this is, if I'm not gonna do it for this, I'll never do it. That is, that is awesome. Woo! Yeah, done. Best ever flip for 189th. Day has pretty much been a massive part of everything. Drop and roll. Like his main job here is like filming, helping Robbie. There's loads of like second angles. He's also done a load of other stuff. All the rad vinyl work on the, the sort of fake speakers that we made, painting. He's like so important to pretty much everything we ever do. Hi. Pretty sweet, like we've been shooting for a few days and with sort of mixed success. We've got like 35 of our mates, friends and family have like showed up outside and they're going to be the crowd for the night. So it should be interesting. None of them have really seen like any of this sort of outfit. So it'll be interesting to see what they actually think of it. It's pretty right, I don't know what they're expecting but it should be cool. My favourite thing in the world is directing lots of people that I've never met before. I love feeling really awkward, shy, and you know, just special. childhood homie, he, uh, he used to teach me some stunts on his bike, taught me everything he knew. I think he used to be able to do uh, seven front ups on a Trek 930 one day. I was pretty stoked on that, but uh, he's been filming like all the behind the scenes stuff. So uh, it's been good. Yeah. Yeah. Fine. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
field. Camera's out. to get this done. Yeah, dude. <laughs> so tired, <I> that was <laughs> awesome. Some said this is a riding video. Not sure what this is, but it's not riding. Here we have some madness, I think. It's probably the first things I ever thought of about, you know, trying to do something that was a little bit kind of rock and roll themed in terms of tricks. So, of course, I wanted to do a knee slide on stage, but jump off my bike, try my very best to slide across the stage, and then land back on my bike on the other side. So, here we are. actually sliding across this thing and the bike's staying straight and it's there for me to to get. If somebody calls out in the video, I saw you wearing socks in the hippie hop knees, but like, why? <laughs> pretty wild. Danny comes up oh, with some pretty big yeah, trees, yeah, yeah, yeah. and they actually happen. What time is it? It's um, coming up to 11. I'm trying to get really well, but it's looking incredible. Looking awesome. Wow, I <laughs> <laughs> okay. I What time is it? Like three in the morning. How long have we been doing that for? Oh, goodness me. I was like, almost didn't press record because I thought it just didn't look right. It was like too dialed. Killed it. Yeah, that's good. That. Can I get my socks back? <laughs> <laughs> Can I get my socks back? <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. 
just setting up the lights for Miles or Ronnie McTavish. <laughs> You got a message for these wannabes? Yeah. That's these good. guys think they can get in the metal scene. Yeah. They've got another thing coming. <laughs> Have you got a message for these clowns? Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Concentrate. I'm not helping on this. Well, that's not... Well, that wasn't what we were quite expecting there, folks. Anyway, luckily for us, we're joined by Rob Halford of... I get cheese down your first. Well... That wasn't what we were quite expecting there, folks. Well, that wasn't what we were quite expecting there, folks. Joining us now, legendary metal god, Rob Halford of Judas Priest. Got a nice wee IKEA backdrop here. <laughs> Being straight from New York. Cannot believe we're gonna name Rob Halford. I'm trying to sit still. <laughs> this is an exciting day. We pretty much finished the video and we got a last minute call. Basically we managed to get Rob Halford uh, for the final scene of the music video, which he's pretty much my sort of music heroes. I can't believe it. <laughs> How are your palms? A bit sweaty. <laughs> So literally I spent like was it four years of my life in my Donald Cycles basement with this man here. And oh, we man. literally we listened to Judas Priest every day. Turbo so, lover ten times a day. So the idea that we're we're meeting him today and also having him for the end of the video is that's insane. Certainly for making a a sort of team video we wanted to do something really different and We'll see how it goes. You can't really decide, you know, when you've been working on for so long and so hard, you can't really tell what you've got, you know, so it'll be interesting to see next week when it goes out. Um, I think it's going to do, I think it's going to do really, really well. Because, I mean, what, what you do isn't that, that far a stretch from what we do in terms of the, the creative sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you've got your bike and the moves that, you've probably got some standard moves that you like to show off. Yeah. But then you're always looking for a, a new idea. Yeah, for sure. You're trying to come up with just a different angle. Yeah. And it's the same with us in, in priest and in music, really. How many goals did you have to go to do to get there? Uh, I think we about 280 <laughs> <laughs> I'm Ron McTavish, this is the Channel 6 News. Good night. Rory McTavish. Oh, Ronnie. Ronnie McTavish. Yeah. Okay. Is there a... To be quite honest, Ronnie, I think that was a load of crap. If these drop and roll guys think they're welcome to the metal scene, they've got another thing coming. Uh,